Abkhazi is an Austroasiatic language spoken primarily in Meghalaya state in India by the Khazi people. Khazi is part of the Austroasiatic language family, and is fairly closely related to the Munda branch of that family, which is spoken in east-central India. Although most of the 1.6 million Khazi speakers are found in Meghalaya state, the language is also spoken by a number of people in the hill districts of Assam bordering with Meghalaya and by a sizable population of people living in Bangladesh. Close to the Indian border, Khazi has been associate official language in Meghalaya since 2005 and as of May 2012 was no longer considered endangered by UNESCO. Khazi is rich in folklore and folktale, and behind most of the names of hills, mountains, rivers, waterfalls, birds, flowers, and animals there is a story. Dialects Khazi has significant dialectal variation. Several dialects have only partial mutual intelligibility, and Bhoi and Nonglung are distinct enough to be sometimes considered separate languages. Other dialects are Sora, Kynrium, and War. Sora and War are 75% similar lexically. Sora dialects is standard. Script. In the past, the Khazi language had no script of its own. William Carey attempted to write the language with the Assamese script between 1813 and 1838. A large number of Khazi books were written in the Assamese script, including the famous book Kani Yom Jong Ka Khazi or The Rule of the Khasis, which is an important manuscript of the Khazi religion. The Welsh missionary, Thomas Jones, in 1841 wrote the language in the Latin script. As a result, the Latin alphabet of the language has a few similarities with the Welsh alphabet. The first journal in Khazi was on Onkit Kubal published at Morflang in 1889 by William Williams. Alphabet capital letters A, B, K, D, E, G, N, H, I, I, J, L, M, N, N, O, P, R, S, T, U, W, Y. Small letters A, B, K, D, E, G, N, H, I, I, J, L, M, N, N, O, P, R, S, T, U, W, Y. A, B, C. D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, X, Z, Phonology, Grammar, Nouns and Noun Phrases Word Order The order of elements in a Kazi noun phrase is noun, as can be seen from the following examples. Gender Kazi has a pervasive gender system. There are four genders in this language. U masculine ka feminine I diminutive ki plural humans and domestic animals have their natural gender. Ka kmie backquote mother, u kpa backquote father, ka siar backquote hen, u siar backquote rooster, Rabel writes. The structure of a noun gives no indication of its gender, nor does its meaning, but Kazi natives are of the impression that nice, small creatures and things are feminine while big, ugly creatures and things are masculine. This impression is not borne out by the facts. There are countless examples of desirable and lovely creatures with masculine gender as well as of unpleasant or ugly creatures with feminine gender, though there are several counterexamples. Rabel says that there is some semantic regularity in the assignment of gender for the following semantic classes. The matrilineal aspect of the society can also be observed in the general gender assignment, where so, all central and primary resources associated with day-to-day -day activities are signified as feminine, whereas masculine signifies the secondary, the dependent or the insignificant. Classifiers Kazi has a classifier system, apparently used only with numerals. Between the numeral and noun, the classifier Tiley is used for non-humans, and the classifier Ngut is used for humans, e.g. adjectives. There is some controversy about whether Kazi has a class of adjectives. Roberts cites examples like the following. 
In nearly all instances of attributive adjectives, the apparent adjective has the prefix bar, which seems to be a relativizer. There are, however, a few adjectives without the bar prefix. When the adjective is the main predicate, it may appear without any verb be. In this environment, the adjective is preceded by an agreement marker, like a verb. Thus it may be that Kazi does not have a separate part of speech for adjectives, but that they are a subtype of verb. Prepositions and prepositional phrases Kazi appears to have a well-developed group of prepositions, among them bad, with, and da, with, na, from, ha, in, at, jong, of the following are examples of prepositional phrases. Verbs and verb phrases agreement verbs agree with third-person subjects in gender, but there is no agreement for non-third persons. The masculine and feminine markers, you, and, ka, are used even when there is a noun phrase subject. Tense marking tense is shown through a set of particles that appear after the agreement markers but before the verb. Past is a particle, la, and future is, yn. Negation negation is also shown through a particle, ym, which appears between the agreement and the tense particle. There is a special past negation particle, shime, in the past which replaces the ordinary past, la. Copulas the copula is an ordinary verb in kazi, as in the following sentence. Causative verbs kazi has a morphological causative, pn. Sentences word order word order in simple sentences is subject verb object. However, VSO order is also found, especially after certain initial particles, like hangter, then. Case marking sometimes the object is preceded by a particle ya. Yeah. Roberts says, Iowa, 2, 4, against implies direct and immediate relation. Hence it's being the sign of the dative and of the accusative case as well. It appears from Roberts that Kazi has differential object marking. Since only some objects are marked accusative, Roberts notes that nouns that are definite usually have the accusative and those that are indefinite often do not. Rabel says, the use of ya is optional in the case of one object. In the case of two objects one of them must have ya preceding. If one of the objects is expressed by a pronoun, it must be preceded by ya. Passive kazi has a passive, but it involves removing the agent of the sentence without putting the patient in subject position. Compare the following active-passive pair where the patient continues to have accusative case and remains in the object position. This type of passive is used, even when the passive agent is present in a prepositional phrase. Questions yes no questions seem to be distinguished from statements only by intonation. WH questions don't involve moving the WH element. Embedded clauses subordinate clauses follow the main verb that selects them. Relative clauses follow the nouns that they modify and agree in gender. Sample text in Kazi some Kazi words and phrases numbers publications in Kazi. There are a number of books as well as newspapers in the Kazi language. The most famous Kazi poet is Yu So So Tham. The online newspaper Yu Mo 4 is published in the Kazi language.